George had grown tired of the same old bathtub frog and boat races. Oh. He needed new tub toys. Done with your bath, George? <laughs> well, then, please get back in the tub. You're puddling. <laughs> this was George's box of stray stuff, none of which had ever been played with in the tub. <laughs> None of this stuff made for exhilarating monkey tub action. This disappointing bath was over. <laughs> Some of this stuff was moving on its own. <laughs> These were good tub toys. It was a good thing George had watched him closely. <laughs> Righty tighty shuts off the water. He did everything Mr. Auger had done, but didn't find a clog. If the last clog moved to the kitchen, maybe this clog had moved downstairs. <coughs> this was too big a job for one monkey. He'd better go get the man with the yellow hat from the store. Being a good plumber, George reopened the water main so everyone would have water. Being a monkey, he forgot he'd opened the taps in the apartment. Hundley was relieved. With George gone, nothing sloppy could happen. <laughs> Pipes should always be properly tightened. George, when you came to the store and wanted me to come home, did it have anything to do with the water pouring off of our balcony? No! Did you call the plumber yet? Is something wrong? I was on the roof feeding the pigeons. Holy hinges! Humbly! <laughs> Oh boy, found your clog. You can't dump food in the dishwasher. <laughs> and from now on, leave plumbing to the experts. That would be me. <laughs> his plumbing day's over. George enjoyed a nice hot bath with his new tub toy. <laughs> Guaranteed never to slip down the drain. Thank <laughs> you.